here at Arabia, excellence is the rule and not the exception. We're a Title I school, 56% free and reduced lunch. We're 98% African American. They have to maintain a 2.5 GPA, 51% academics, 49% everything else. When the students come in, the expectation is we're going to sign you up for the hardest classes possible. I got a 96 and I was going to retake it to get 100. All of our kids end up taking at least four sciences, which is required, but they can take up to as many as six sciences. I want you to see what I've done. Science is a way of thinking. We try to immerse them in the experience of science. So we want to engage them in experiences that will increase their critical thinking and problem solving skills. The embryo basically, so it will germinate faster. Dual enrollment is an awesome program. One, they get a chance to experience college before leaving high school. Two, they get a chance to earn college credit. And three, it actually is a financial saving in the end as well. Students who take advantage of those programs after two years, their junior and senior years, can graduate with an associate's degree. Every kid takes the EIC class, which is connecting the environment with the curriculum, so they learn the research process in that class. So they identify a problem, and then their charge is to go out and research that problem and come up with a solution for it. We use our environment here because there's a waterfall out back, there's a lake out back. We have like an outdoor classroom, we have trails, we have a greenhouse. Our school is linked with the Nature Conservancy for an internship called LEAF, and LEAF stands for Leaders in Environmental Action for the Future. It's a paid internship and we're sent out to like a certain location within the United States to do environmental field work. Arabia Mountain High School has 14 pathways. If you want to choose nuclear, choose nuclear. So we have the fine arts pathway, and in the fine arts pathway, there's the band and the orchestra, as well as visual arts. The business pathway, which includes entrepreneurship. The information technology pathway, which includes computer science. We have the medical pathway, culinary pathway, engineering pathway, and we have the energy pathway. In a career pathway, kids take three years consecutively of courses in a specific subject area. So it's almost like picking a major in college. Their senior year, we try to connect them with companies around this area where they can take that knowledge and they can use it. I want to be a cook, but at the same time, I want to be a lawyer. I want to be a neonatal nurse in the future. I will be attending Georgia Southern University in the fall to study mechanical engineering. The year before last, we had a 100% graduation rate. Last year, we had 98.7. This year, we plan to have a 100% graduation rate. So we're doing good things here. <laughs>